Hi, welcome to Social Research Insights. In this video cast, I am going to show you how to understand the behavior of light sensor, uh, which is also known as LDR, light dependent resistor. Uh, this is LDR is basically a resistor that which change the flow of current in response to the light that present in the environment. So this is a small circuit in which I have two uh, output devices one is Arduino and the other is a uh, diode one end of the uh, light sensor is connected to a voltage pin on the microcontroller in this case Arduino and the other end is connected to an analog pin which is A0 A which you can observe here in this video that I am showing and the other end is connected to LDR which in turn is uh, connected to the ground so that the entire circuit is closed with these connections. The purpose of this video is to understand how this light sensor really uh, reacts to the light that which falls upon it and and how they are going to affect these two output devices. So in this video as I said we have two devices one is the microcontroller the other is the LED. So if we stop the light and and that must uh, prevent the LED glowing which I mean uh, I precisely mean to say that in this video you can see that the LED is glowing and uh, if I block the light with the help of my hand and that must be able to prevent the, la the, the the current passing to the LED and then as a result the LED must stop glowing. So when I stop the light and the LED stop glowing and when I re release my finger from the LDR the L LED glow would simply mean that we can control the behavior of LED with the help of this uh, light sensor. So this way we can construct simple circuits and study the uh, behavior of uh, sensors and uh, and now I'm going to show you how to study the behavior of the same uh, sensor with the help of Arduino. Uh, beginning of this video I've explained how to establish connections uh, around LDR light dependent resistor which is connected to the analog uh, pin on Arduino and also a, an LED. So we'll be watching the behavior of the uh, light sensor, in this case it is LDR, uh, through two output uh, uh, entities, that is number one, uh, the serial monitor through sketch, I mean uh, the ID for the uh, light uh, sensor, uh, I mean Arduino, and this and as a second entity is the L LED, uh, it's a light emitting diode, uh, will be we have observed how the light emitting diode behaves against uh, uh, the the sensor and in this video we are going to see we are going to see how to observe the behavior of the light uh, 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 dependent resistor uh, which are which is also known as the light uh, sensor through the code written in the sketch now if you observe there are two parts in this code that is void setup and uh, void loop there are so many tutorials online you can learn how to write the code uh, in sketch uh, to regulate the behavior of uh, the sensors uh, through Arduino and uh, if you observe in this code we have the two parts the first one is the void setup in which uh, we are going to declare the port uh, or also which is also known as the board way uh, in order to see the read the, the, the or observe the behavior of the light sensor uh, numerically that is what is the most important thing otherwise we can understand the behavior through LED but whereas the advantage of uh, connecting a light sensor through Arduino is to measure and understand uh, the behavior uh, numerically and use those uh, numerals for further analysis and now the part number two is the loop in which I declared a variable known as the sensor value uh, into which I am going to read the uh, the output from the light sensor 
as I have shown you uh, earlier that the light sensor is connected to the analog pin A0 and this A0 pass the information to the variable which we are uh, which I defined here as a sensor value and I'm going to print those values uh, keeping in loop so that the values will be displayed uh, in the sensor sens serial monitor and I used another command called delay I'm going to keep some gap between any two consecutive values and the gap is going to be 1000 milliseconds and uh, we can uh, we can change this value in order to make the values either fast or slow okay I already uploaded uh, and the Arduino is connected to the computer and let's see the values in the serial monitor now this is these are the values that are appearing in the in the serial monitor now let me uh, switch off all the lights in my environment or in the room uh, and let us notice what's going to happen uh, uh, to the uh, how the sensor is going to react to the change in the environment now you can see that the values drastically fell down from earlier the values the values started from 420 420 20, 20 something like that and now the values for the, the value fell down to 408 or 408 something like that so we can see the the and i'll i'll turn on my uh, uh, light again or i will expose the sensor to the light and let's see that's uh, I see now you see now the all of a sudden values increased to 452 and uh, varying somewhere in between now I expose the sensor to LED I'll take the LED off now again the values fell down to 408 so in this way we can use the microcontrollers in order to study the behavior of the sensors in this example we studied the behavior of the uh, LDR mm and you can read uh, the the electronic uh, properties of this LDR online okay if you like my video please subscribe to my channel and stay tuned thank you thanks for watching this video